Ah, hello everybody, it's your boy Ronnie Bizzle coming to you from my backyard of my home, of the Bizzle home. <sighs> Weather's nice, it is. As you saw, it is May 8th, 2028, 14 in the p.m. And as I'm recording this, in about almost four hours from now, uh, phase one reopening of Nevada is about to begin. Um, some businesses will get to open. Um, let me look here. I got my computer out because I have a lot of details there. But it looks like for Nevada, starting midnight, the phase one openings will be barbershops, hair salons, and nail salons. My wife is really looking forward to the nail salon part of it. She actually has an appointment Saturday <laughs> morning to get her nails done. Uh, she's been going crazy on her nails. Um, Drive-in movie theaters can reopen, which is weird because Las Vegas only has one drive-in. It's um, been there a couple times over there by the Texas station in North Las Vegas. Kind of an old school look to it. It's really, really cool. Uh, a couple of restaurants are going to open up. Uh, let's see here. Self-service stations, salad bars, beverage stations must remain closed. Uh... Bar restaurants will remain resume opening, uh, but there can be no more than 50% of available seating capacity, excluding bar seating. Tables must be placed at least six feet apart. Um, some retail businesses are going to open, um, but and they are, and they're allowing customers inside the store. Uh, they're going to be limited to 50% of allowed occupancy per local fire code. Open air, ma ma open air malls may reopen, which means the outlet malls can open up. We have uh, we have two outlet malls here in the city, um, Premium and the one Town Square, which are really really good malls. Let's see here, auto dealerships may open, <laughs> which is weird because who's gonna buy a car at this time? <laughs> so some of the things that are still that won't reopen during this phase one is stuff like aquariums, buffets, gyms, nightclubs, racetrack, and of course brothels. <laughs> because you know in Nevada, we have to take care of the brothels. <laughs> also, um, casinos. And this is where my part of Vegas is still affected. You know, I think the casinos is probably gonna be the last thing they're gonna open uh, because it's the business that attracts the most people at once. You know, that, like movie theaters, bowling alleys, stuff like that. And um, so as far as me going back to work, it's gonna be, uh, still gonna be a while. You know, still kind of um, not sure when I'm gonna work, so I'm guessing that I'm still not gonna be working this whole summer. So that kind of sucks. Um, uh, but there's a little story I want to tell you about what happened but today. You know, today I went to a doctor's appointment. Uh, as many of you guys may have known, I had this uh, thyroid condition that I've had since I was in the military when I was 21. It's called Graves' disease. And it's like a, it's like a, the thyroid produces enough, too much like metabolism. So you're, 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 a, you're a hyperthyroid. Um, in order to remedy this issue, I had to take uh, medication every day for the rest of my life. It's like two pills. Every morning I take it. Um, so I got that, got the refills for that. But the scary part is I think maybe if I don't go back to work soon and if this, if the casinos are not open the next couple of phases, I think it's gonna be about phase four or five. I'm not sure how many phases there are. I think that this may be it <laughs> because I think my benefits, if I don't get my job back, are going to end at like June 30th. So I'm a little leery about that. Um, you know, I have a backup plan. As you guys who watch the vlog know that I uh, was in the military. So I'm actually in the middle of doing um, VA benefits, trying to get the VA healthcare so I can continue on my, my care of my thyroid. Um, even if my my uh, benefits of my job goes away in, in June. So 
I mean, I'm scared at that point, but hopefully I'll be able to get to be a bit of it. But it just, it sucks right now because I think we're entering, as I record this, day number 54 of the, uh, the quarantine. And um, I know a lot of the casinos, a lot of the uh, people who are furloughed, uh, their benefits are going to end soon. Um, I think... I know the company that I work for is going to be June 30th if we get hired. But I know some other, I think some other companies are going to end like in August or September or whatever. Or maybe they'll extend. I don't know. Who knows? But I just, I'm um, trying to prepare myself for uh, what's uh, going to come. <sighs> so, I don't know. It's still not out of the woods. Still feeling a lot of anxiety. Still feeling uh, not the best feeling in the world. But, um, you know, one good thing is to get to enjoy things like this. You know, the, the weather right now here in Vegas is really, really nice. Today it was like almost 90, but it was like not really like really hot, really crazy. Like right now it's, it feels good. Um, maybe it's like 70 degrees and there's no breeze. And I can tell from just how the night sky just beautiful. You know, I live over here almost like 30 minutes from the strip and I freaking love it and I just you know you live this far away from everything that's going on you kind of you know away from it there's a lot of things to um, um, get your thoughts like lately I've been in my backyard a lot just thinking about the future thinking about what's going to happen if uh, the worst is, is happening you know every day you know you just read the news and you watch the news and especially in Nevada and you just don't know when Nevada the gaming part of it is going to be like full swing <sighs> so you know every time I look at a every time I see some good news like oh there's a vaccine going on or, or some kind of cure or I say oh yeah there's going to be vaccines so everybody will get their vaccine and then everybody will be coming back to Vegas and then I think uh then they, then they say it's not going to be like 2021. So, <laughs> oh boy, it just sucks. So, like I said, I come out here and I just think about stuff. Think about life. Think about the world and how it is, you know. <sighs> Anyways, um, I think that's going to be it for this video. I just want to show you, you know, what I've been doing. Show you what it's like peacefully here in Vegas. Oh, you see my cat right there? There's my cat walking. <laughs> Making a little cameo appearance. Anyways, that's going to be it for this video. Um, thank you for watching. Um, hope you guys have a good night. Hope everybody's doing well. Hope everybody's staying safe. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Thanks for watching, everybody. Ronnie Bizzle TV.